Hi, just wanted to get a bit of a tidbit. Um, when starting off art, a lot of people don't think about it, but a good thing to think about when you're starting out is what type of paper you're using. As you can see, I'm at Walmart and I'm looking at one of the notebooks they have as an option in the kids art and crafts section. As you can see, it does say the number of pages in there and it says how, what the dimensions are, but it doesn't say the weight, like where my thumb is in this shot. Um, that's important because even when you're sketching, weight determines the thickness of the paper, which can be handy for when you decide to put inks down, like if you're using alcohol markers, or if you're sketching and you're using an eraser, because sometimes thinner paper also equals smudging. Um, in this shot, you see me with a mixed media one. They tend to have a larger um, weight because they're meant to be used for a number of different mediums. Um, sometimes watercolor, but most people say that they don't guarantee it. As you can see, that one is 98 pounds while the other one is 70 pounds. And um, a good example for mixed media and the reason why they have watercolor paper is watercolor paper not only is it much thicker like if you flip the pages open and you touch the paper you can definitely tell a difference with watercolor paper you can definitely see a different texture um, it's much thicker um, sometimes they'll say what kind of press they are but yeah that's a little tidbit for people who who wants to start off drawing.